If you've been wondering why these early modern and medieval dishes have three feet on them, the first reason is that if you've got a table with an uneven surface, then they will stand stable anyway. Second reason, they were sometimes used with a heat source, so they were put by the fire. You can see soot on the original pieces. Because of the feet, there is a proper heat distribution under the surface of the plate, comparable to what you have with a cauldron or a pipkin. And a third reason... When the dishes were fired, they would be leaning against each other like this. And with all the glaze, there was a decent risk of them to stick together. This dish is more than 400 years old. And as you can see, there are imprints from the feet of the neighboring dish. Now, because of the small contact surface, there isn't that much damage. This product would have been considered perfectly suitable for sale. Now, I've tried this thing for the first time. These plates are stuck together and I'm going to separate them. This looks good. There are some traces of the top plate in the bottom plate. And it actually looks a lot like the traces on the original pieces. But now I'm curious, if you were a customer, what would you rather have? A perfectly spotless plate or a bit of damage for the sake of authenticity? Please let me know in the comments. Tot ziens!